Hello everyone and welcome back to another part of Let's Play Eador, Masters of the Broken World on Overlord Difficulty. We are on uh, Pellet's homeworld and um, things are not going exactly according to plan. Uh, we have problems basically with everything. We don't have enough locations to level up our warrior. Our economy really sucks doing plus to go per turn. Uh, on turn 41 already, I'm really not used to uh, doing this bad. And Pellet is doing quite well. He's maybe doing even better than I thought. He is in the third ring already, I think. Uh, holy crap! Look at uh, the size of his uh, of his land. So maybe I'm even doing worse than I thought, really. And um, yeah, question is if he managed to get the territory thanks to some alliance and uh, a bit of luck, uh, you know, with placement of the proper of uh, of provinces or the proper race, or if he's really doing that well and managed to conquer such a huge part of the map just by force. But we'll see. I'll try to do something about this, but I have to say I don't like this at all. And um, it really can happen that we'll just lose this. Uh, yeah, let's see what uh, we can do, how far we can get. And maybe I'll be able to somehow turn this around. It really depends on how long it will take him to get uh, through fourth ring that's here. If he uh, can do that, you know, in next uh, 50 turns, then it's bad. So now it's all about RNG how long uh, Bellet will let me live. So let's start. I wanted to check my gear and repair it. And also, we have a ring here, so let's equip that. We managed to get it from a quest. And uh, I think this is all we can get in the capital. I've been thinking if I should take this magic weapon. I'll probably just take another weapon now when I'm thinking about it. And I'll go after the uh, only targets we have here, which are these undead and two necromancers. For now, that's real. All we can do, I was thinking about these spiders, but their poison would just destroy me. Druids, I'd lose uh, uh, my healer there, most likely, or some barbarians. So only undead are viable now. We at least have a quest for zombies, so we'll get closer to finishing that. But at this point, we mostly need just experience for our hero. We'll get higher level, more skills, uh, higher numbers on everything, and uh, then we'll be able to clear tougher locations. It's hard to get here, and uh, our scout really fails big time, finding nothing there. Keep exploring. I'm not surprised that he again didn't find anything. Okay, where do we start? Uh, probably those necromancers. And I'll leave those undead uh, in case I'm hurt and need an easier fight uh, to uh, heal everything back to full, you know, prepare for something else. Um, and I hope we'll be able to kill necromancers. If not, then we are really in trouble. Okay, no surprise here. And where are they? Oh, this is a weird positioning, really weird. I'm even thinking about moving down. And do something like... Oh, come on. Do something like this. Hero should be able to do something with skeletons if they decide to go uh, this way. And two, four. I will take one hit from the ghoul, and then I will web him and hopefully kill him. So let's see what they're gonna do. Awesome, fear. Yeah, that's exactly what I don't need. This guy is going to panic next turn. This is just bad. Uh, 
Oh, move to the north. Yeah, what about you? I want to move forward. And I hope that I'm gonna stop this skeleton. He's not gonna get to my barbarians. Or too close to them. Okay, there is one panicking barbarian. You can move closer now and attack. Don't need spells yet. And I really hope that the ghost is gonna attack this barbarian because uh, that would most likely enrage him and return all the morale back. Whatever. No, of course not. Well, heal up. Now, the hero will just have to take some hits. And you guys do your best. What about this skeleton? Can you just attack this barbarian and do some damage? Help me a bit. This is fine. No, of course not. Come on. Why? Oh, the hero is in trouble. I need to kill that ghoul. Perfect. Hmm. You will have to web that zombie. Keep healing. Okay, now what I can do is move back because I ended the turn next to the skeleton. I can use astral energy and just get. Oh, really? I can't get out of there with astral energy. Uh, I thought I'll be able to move. But I might be able to move like this. Okay, now I'm out of range of that uh, zombie and I'll be able to heal the hero. You have to hide. You'll get your heal and uh, next turn you can return to the fight. Okay, heal for you, he'll move down, and you can even do some damage. Turn around. Finish that stupid zombie. Fine, fine, fine. So we will uh, survive this, but uh, I want this barbarian back. Can I just somehow make the sorcerer attack him? I can. Sure, so I think I'll just let them be for now and I'll try to wait if uh, uh, he will enrage. Not yet. Come on. Not yet. Is it still safe? It seems it is. You can do it. <laughs> Jesus. Well, I can still wait. Maybe it will happen. No. Now that uh, sorcery can't do uh, any damage. Hmm. Well, I'll still wait. Get uh, this guy closer, at least heal him up, and yeah, this guy should be able to get some extra stamina from the kill here. Come on, you can do it. Okay, there we go. At least something, but he's not uh, 
Uh, he's not gonna be back uh, to full morale in the next fight. That was some really bad luck that uh, he didn't enrage there. Okay, what can we do? Hmm. I'll even take defense here. Attack for you. Can't afford any medals. Uh, probably morale for our healer. And what do we have? Chaos spawn. I don't care about that. But we have plate overshoes, which is actually not bad. Plus 5 hit points. That's actually decent loot. Okay, so at least something. And we have 181 gold. I don't think we can do anything with that. Uh, let's see. What do I want to go for next? Uh, I was thinking either weapon store to get uh, two-handed sword or try to get to Necromancer's Guild as fast as possible. There's quite a few buildings required for that, so it will take a while to get to it. But um, it will take us also quite a while to actually get tier 2 spell slot. And um, <laughs> might not be possible to even get that far unless I get better gear. So I guess it will be the sword first, and then I will try to get the, uh, to get to that guild. Uh, so for for the weapon store we need farmers market and I'll spend all the money on this but yeah why not let's build it we should get some uh, gold next turn again from next fight uh, let's go after necromancers again it wasn't that bad it was just they were not targeting the one barbarian I uh, needed Otherwise, it was quite smooth. So, let's try it. And there are two tier 2 units, so uh, it's quite decent experience. Okay, no more swamps up here. And let's try something like this, uh, leave this barbarian on the most exposed tile maybe uh, he'll enrage when he's standing like this he should take quite a bit of damage so hope it will work okay positioning, oh, it's actually quite good depends uh, if this cool will go up or down but we'll see about that. Oh, there he goes. You got to be kidding me now. Can he survive all the damage? He'll take a hit from the ghoul. Okay, now when I don't need it, he's moving, of course. And when I needed it, he just was standing like a lemon there. And was doing anything. And I hope that one hit will enrage him. Uh, you can move forward a bit, I think. Please. Finally something. Okay, that's good. Oh, now this guy is in trouble. Yeah, sure, why not? Heal up. And I really need to kill that uh, that ghoul. <laughs> you can't be serious. Can we get a kill there? Of course not. Oh, come on. This is starting to be really frustrating. Turn around at least. He'll get a heal and I hope that uh, the ghoul will just uh, attack this barbarian. Okay, this is fine. Okay, good. At least something. Now, 
Eh, now the hero is panicking. I have to say the sorcerer is doing really good job here. Okay, you have to retreat. Hero will get a kill and get some uh, uh, get some round back. And I think the safest thing to do now is move forward with both guys, and I hope that they will be able to kill that one skeleton. Good. You should survive even with the disease sticking on you. I hope. That looks fine. Both of you guys move back. You need a lot of healing. Turn around. Hero is panicking. That sorcerer completely destroyed me. Move away. And you need to heal. And I have a feeling that uh, this barbarian is gonna die now. There's no way I'd be able to survive the hit from the zombie and the take from the poison. Oh, he will. What the hell? I didn't expect that, but yeah, I'm not gonna complain. Okay. I'll just heal through the damage somehow for a while. I will go forward. I hope that the sorcerer will go after this barbarian. How many heals do you have? One. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. And he can't kill him? Sure, why not? Now, without the support from the hero, this is bad. Uh, turn around. Okay. And the hero is back. So, what can I do? Move, 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 block the path. Turn around. Move back. Um. Okay, this guy will take the hit next turn, and I don't think I'll be able to do anything about that. Maybe like this, this should help. Good. Move back. You will move in. How much damage can you do? <laughs> no damage at all. Uh, you should get a heal next turn. Okay, let's attack. Hero can take the counter-attack. You can heal. And I think you can move and attack. Okay, once again, next turn the healer will get a heal. So I'll be able to keep the barbarian alive and uh, give him astral energy for some uh, 
for some uh, extra stamina and I should be able to end this next turn. But hell, this was tough. You know, just get a kill like this. Okay. So, somehow, everyone survived. <laughs> but at one point, it looked uh, really, really grim. And um, I was even afraid that me, it may actually use, uh, lose um, half of the army. Like the healer and uh, one barbarian, maybe two barbar barbarians even, were in trouble there. And if I lost the healer, that, that would be really bad. I needed him here. Okay, but everyone is alive. So let's hope we get something decent uh, for this super tough fight. Will for victory or I'm even thinking about taking these medals, even if I basically can't afford them. I just need more damage to get to tougher fights. Um, no, for now I'll still pass on them. Uh, creation. Oh, that's uh, decent. Well, it depends what we gonna get from that uh, creation. If we get the uh, item for warrior, then it will be good, otherwise it's waste. And summon imp, which we can sell. Hmm. I was hoping for something better. Ancient ruins. I found something. Um... Let's. Oh, I should start spamming Enchanted Coffer. Forget about that. Okay, I'll start uh, doing that next turn. First, I want to, want to try that creation. What are you gonna get from that? Please give me something. <sighs> Whatever. You can probably hear the frustration from my voice. That's not uh, really uh, going well on this shard. What have you found? These demonologists. How does it look like with our army? You know what? I'll just explore maybe for a while. Like one, two turns to heal a bit. I don't want to, I want to risk anything. Oh, finally some luck. 100 gold for nothing. Good, keep exploring. How does it look like? 94%. Then. Once we are done in this province, I'll have to go somewhere else, and I'll probably go to Capitol because in Capitol it's guaranteed that you'll find uh, a lot of locations. And uh, even though I won't be able to get that much gold from locations in swamps, I just need experience. I need the hero to start leveling. We have like what's the turn? Forty-five, and we have level four hero. No way. Okay, so how does it look like? Um, one more turn to have a help the scout explore this. Nothing and nothing. I can't believe this. How? How bad choice this province was. It seems log seemed logical when I picked the province to go here, because it was closest to the position of uh, our hero uh, back there. And there were some targets, and it turned out to be a horrible decision. Okay, on that. At least we're gonna get more zombies from this. And it doesn't look that bad anymore with our units. We also should get a level up from this. Um, and didn't I say that I should start using that enchanted coffer on capital? Okay, we have 300, which is not bad. 
uh, I mean 247 plus you only got like 100 for that sword so I think I'll wait Everyone except the hero is full morale. By the way, did I see that correctly that we have six units against us? With a ghoul? Oh, really? Okay, this is interesting. This is tier 2 under the army. And if I can somehow do this, this is actually good because it means more experience. If I can do this without losses, because the hero won't be of much help with his morale. His damage will be like non existent almost. But maybe I can do something about that. Get him close to some skeletons when they die. That might help. Just have to be careful with it, cool. Okay. Move on the hill. Oh, let's see. That ghoul should be slowed down quite a bit. Okay, do your best. So, this guy can get a kill. Good. Might as well turn around. I still have time for that ghoul, so that's good. Can you get a kill? Good. You will get a heal and hero will get a kill. Okay, that looks better. Now, can I afford to take a hit from that ghoul? Or do I just want to fap him on this style? If I move like this, then I will fap him here most likely. You will move closer, you can move closer as well. But now I have to use web. Guys, do your best. Okay. And turn. You will move closer. You will move all the way and you will move out of range there. And just give me astral energy and finish that ghoul. And I just uh, hope that those zombies won't find a way how to kill this barbarian. Nope. Okay. No. Who's gonna be the target for a web? I think this is on B, and I'll just heal this barbarian. If 
Oh, this is tougher than tier 4 fights, because I already mentioned it in the let's play, that when you go against tier 4 armies, you are ready for it, but uh, when you are forced to go into fight like this with a uh, uh, low level army, it's at least for me, it's a lot more interesting and uh, actually even more challenging. Uh, what can we do here? I think you will need astral energy. And end the turn. Okay, move in. We can do some damage. Now, you need healing. This barbarian will, su will survive one turn without healing. You can even throw your axe. Good, good, good. This looks fine. Heal up. And finish that. Damn it, this was again quite tough. Level up. Oh, we have command. That's interesting. And uh, weapon master. Yeah, there's no question about this. Plus two attack, plus one counter. It's just uh, exactly what we need. Here. I think double hit points for you. Uh, more stamina here, I'll pass on the metal and um, just give me defense. I can't believe I'm taking defense over Berserker, but uh, yeah, this army, those barbarians are just way too fragile. I need them to take at least a bit less damage to make it easier to keep everyone alive. And healer will take uh, range defense. 200 gold, that's good. But uh, this is a crap loot. Okay, I'll sell both these items. Um, oh, we found something. I can't believe that. The last 2%. Okay, so that's explored. And we have Lizard Man. I don't even know if I want to try them. Uh, Demonologist, that's maybe something we can do. But it's like one of the weakest armies you can find. Just three imps and a shaman. That's not even worth wasting turn. Uh, you buddy. Go to the capital and try to find something here. I hope you'll be more successful. Um, and I can build a weapon store now. So let's do it. I'll probably go after those demonologists. I just don't have targets, so I might as well do something better than nothing. Uh, what's here? Nomads. Maybe even force to go after the centaurs and nomads. I just. Uh, but we would go there from swamps. Even the, the positioning of everything is bad here, because provinces I would consider. Like attacking, uh, we would have bad starting positions. So standing in swamps against all of this and having nothing to cover in. You know, if, if we are going from the forest, I would probably try it and hide my units in forest uh, so they wouldn't take that much damage from ranged attacks. But uh, from swamps, those arrows would just destroy me. Well, I will have to think about uh, future progress of camera. This part is already long enough. I thought you'll be able to kill more stuff, but uh, turned out to be quite quite hard killing even some basic uh, armies. But I hope uh, you still like it. It's um, quite different from uh, probably all previous shards, where it was just uh, you know kill everything around and then rush AI. Uh, a lot more challenging, I have to say. So, hope you'll join me again for the next part. And uh, until then, have a good time. And bye bye.